Overnight, an officer and his partner ambushed in Brooklyn. Without warning, video surveillance shows a male walk up to the officers casually, take out a knife and stab one of the officers in the neck. At some point during the chaotic struggle to subdue the suspect, he managed to grab the gun of one of the cops and shots were fired according to the NYPD. Two other officers positioned a block away sprinted toward the gunfire. Nearly two dozen rounds were fired and officers shot the suspect before rushing him to the hospital in critical condition. It appears to be a completely cowardly, despicable, unprovoked attack on a defenseless police officer and thank God we're not planning a funeral right now. When the dust settled, two cops suffered gunshot wounds to their hands. It's another example of what it means every day, the men and women of the NYPD to protect all of us, to protect our communities no matter what is happening. The officers attacked were working an anti-looting post at Church and Flatbush Avenues during the second night of curfew. An NYPD police explorer and aspiring cop condemning the current climate and said all police officers shouldn't be painted in a bad light. It's senseless in a way because if you're fighting for justice, that wouldn't be a way to achieve a goal. It's the third such attack on the NYPD amid the continued citywide unrest after a sergeant was struck by a hit and run driver in the Bronx and another was bashed in the head with a brick in Manhattan during the looting earlier this week. Finally in Queens, officers dodging death as their cruiser had its windows shot out while responding to a call in Far Rockaway. Back live here in Flatbush this morning. As for those two officers who suffered a gunshot wounds and the officer who was slashed just missing his artery, all three are expected to recover. Police are investigating whether the cops were injured in friendly fire during this wild melee. At this point, the suspect has not yet been publicly identified and is in critical condition. Live in Flatbush, I'm Anthony DiLorenzo, PIX11 News.